Hello everybody and welcome to part 6, or attempt 6 rather, of Let's Play The Binding of Isaac. So let's get started. If you saw my last run, this is directly after that chronologically, even though the videos are going to be a day apart. So I'm feeling a little bit incensed from that last video because I did what, how I feel, what I consider to be quite poorly. Let's do a much better job here and potentially actually make it all the way. I'm getting all these, all these messages and all these tweets from people that are like, dude, I finished the game. Two days ago, you might just really suck. I want to show the haters how wrong they truly are. So we got maybe Mom's Eye here. Tears up. Whoa. I like this. Pretty good. And a new item. Ah, and here is a darker rock. So we'll blow that up and get the money that's trapped inside. As well as two robotic hearts. I don't know if those are actually robotic hearts. But anyway. Oh, here's Lust. And Lust is actually a problem. Because, uh... She, he, it's, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know why it wants me so bad. Look at my character. But uh, it can make charges at you that are actually faster than you can run. So you got to keep your distance. But overall, that was actually pretty easy. Um, let's use these pills next to these rocks just in case it blows them up. Uh, yes. Oh, God. Wow. That actually worked fantastically. It got me like six cents and opened up the secret room. I could not have asked for anything better than that. Yep, fantastic. I don't know if putting out these fires actually gives me a chance to get something in the secret room, but hey, there, I guess that answers my question. Wow, 12 cents already. Doing pretty darn good so far, and I'm happy with the upgrades. I'm excited, I think this could be the one. It just feels, it just feels right right now. Hmm. Can't get to the shop yet, which is good because I'm actually going to try not to spend money because I think someone mentioned that uh, you do need to uh, to have 55 cents, so you can't actually spend any of your money. Any dark rocks in here? Doesn't seem like it. Let's go up here. Uh, when I when I was saying before, I mean uh, you need to have all of your money in order to unlock Kane, the uh, the male character, that, but name male bonus character, I should say. Man pretty good run so far. It's almost like the game realized, like, hey dude, we were kind of being dicks to you last time. We're gonna make it better this time. So I can destroy all this poop twice as fast because of Mom's Tears. Every Let's Play I say this, but it's a sentence I never thought I'd say in real life. I can destroy the poop twice as fast because of Mom's Tears. But anyway, see, I've gotten pretty lucky so far. I'm happy with how this has turned out. So, do I... I don't have any keys. Might as well just go fight the boss. And the boss is going to be Larry Jr. Probably not going to be a problem. Let's use these pills and see what happens there. Speed up. Pretty good. That's a permanent effect. Uh, there's been a little bit of buzz in the comments that pills always have permanent effects. So you should use them uh, like as soon as you get them. That is not always the case. So if anyone tries to tell you that, just show them this video where I farted bombs for 30 seconds. That is quite clearly not a permanent effect. 16 cents already is actually pretty impressive pretty happy about that. And apparently, for seven heart containers, it's not actually in order to unlock the uh, the female character, I forget her name, you don't actually need, um, to ha oh, Jesus, I better pay attention. You don't actually need seven, uh, need to get seven heart containers, you just need to have seven total heart containers, so including the three that you start with. Oh, t man, this has been by far the worst run I've ever had against Larry Jr. I'm just not paying attention. The poop is not forming a good defense for me. Hadrian's Wall, okay. Hadrian's Wall of rat feces or uh, worm feces. Rat feces, what am I talking about? Okay. Seriously bad run, but hopefully Larry will drop some hearts and we can put this all behind us. I got hit like six times. Seven times. Jesus, I, come on. At least drop two hearts for me, please, Larry. Oh, thank you. And an HP up. This has been a remarkably lucky run so far. I'm extraordinarily happy. Let's go down to the next level. Oh, uh, Isaac, what's going on? Yeah, that is some cottage cheese calves on your mother there. Okay, where should we go? Oh, obviously we're going to destroy all the poop in this room. Need all the help I can get. Nothing at all. Oh, never mind. An extra nickel getting pretty close. Oh, I need 34 more cents. Okay, not, not that close, but uh, it's a start anyway. Really, I could really use some homing tears. That would just make my day right now. Okay, only one grandpa fly left. Shoot him diagonally. Oh, watch out. That should do it. 
excellent. Dark Rock? I'm like half colorblind, so I can't tell very easily if these are Dark Rocks or Light Rocks. Oh, okay, okay. Why do I just stand there and take it like a champ? I really need an item that is like a shield or something. Oh, okay, there's one guy down. Can't afford to make stupid mistakes this time. I've got a pretty good setup going so far. I've been really lucky. Okay. Ah, another bomb for me. Could go fight the boss right now. But I think that would be a foolish decision. So let's continue moving. Where do you think that secret room is? Probably above the last room that we were in, right? And now I'm talking to myself. Well, I guess <laughs> what would you call this hobby if not talking to yourself? Mm, more than usual. Ah, there is a dark rock in this room. And that's good, so I have an excuse to use that bomb to get to the treasure chest as well. Now, if only these grandfather flies would come out so I could actually shoot them. There we go, this one's coming. Do I have damage up? I don't think I've gotten a damage up power up yet. Which is a shame, because these guys are taking way too fucking long to kill. And when they fly inside like that, I can't get to- Come on, get out of here! Okay, good. Yep, well worth it. Let's blow up this dark rock, get to the treasure chest, and we're gonna get another bomb out of it as well. And, and two bombs, actually. And a heart, wow. Again, I have been extraordinarily lucky so far. I am very happy with the way this is going, except for the fact that I am getting hit way more than usual. Let's go check it out in here. Ah, it's Gish again. I wonder if, the, if there was a, an update for uh, Binding of Isaac. I can't remember if it's come out yet or if it's coming out soon. But maybe Gish was added in that, because I hadn't seen her before this at all. Oh, 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 almost got hit there. Okay, let's go down. Get this item. Ah, Brother Bobby, that's a good item. It's the one that shoots along with us. Excellent. Uh, I kind of want to go to the shop, but I don't want to spend any money. So instead, let's pay a cent to go to the arcade. Get our cent back. How are we going to do this? Someone told me you can blow up the shell game guy. So I'm going to do that. Success! Exactly what what I needed. Now let's blow up the blood bank. Yeah, get some hearts and some money. Pretty good so far. And blow up the slot machine. Normally I'd play it, but I, I just want the money. I don't want any risk. Alright, got some pills. Pretty happy about the way things are going so far. I know, I've been saying that a lot. Uh, there's some poop in this room. Let's destroy it. Man, if, if people, like, my neighbors must think that I'm a fucking weirdo. Always talking to himself at weird hours of the night. Oh, there's poop in this room. I better destroy it. Oh, this is me. Uh, oh, the pills turn me retarded. Oh, man. So, as the, you need full health in order to unlock that room. I think if I actually get hit one more time, it will open. Oh, no, it, it did open for me. Okay. I thought that the blue health counted as well. Might as well go through here and see what's up with that. What do we got in here? Two cents and a, and a bomb. Fair trade. I think I'll be able to take out this room fairly easily. So far, so good. Grandfather flies, kind of a problem. But I think I'll be okay. Oh, that was bad. Okay, last one, and one more wave. Ah, these guys are nothing special. They do kind of, they kind of move around in a weird way to kind of maybe trap you. And they can also shoot bullets out of their, out of their bodies after they've been defeated. Or after their heads have been taken down. But... By and large, not so bad. So, the secret room, if we're taking bets, probably to the right of this room, or maybe to the right of the room, two rooms above us. Not this room. So it's probably gonna be this room right here. I'm, I've got a good selection of bombs, so I don't feel bad about wasting them like this. Nope. Okay, where could it be then? Hmm, I don't know. Let's fight the boss. With only two bombs left, I would like to I would like to save those, just in case. So when we get to the boss here, I'll use this pill and see if maybe it gives me an upgrade. Ah, uh, Monstro, no no problems here. Always a good boss to get. Let's use the pills. Range up, excellent. Can't complain about that at all. Oh, I can complain about that, though. Although it's totally my own fault that I got hit. Come on, buddy. Monstro, I think Monstro might have more health than a lot of the other monsters. But he is probably the easiest. The Duke of Flies pretty easy as well. I can't remember, I might have said in the last video that the Duke of Flies is the easiest. Uh, if so, I'm a dirty hypocrite and never trust a word I say. Hmm. Alright, come on. Oh! Oh, that was really dumb of me. Well, my, my play has been poor, but my luck has been fantastic. And you know what they say, it's better to be lucky than to be good. 
What item did we get? Ah, another HP up. So what do we have? We have five heart containers right now. Good. Two more and we should unlock that secret character. And we still got a lot of levels to go, which is excellent. If I could find those secret rooms, I'd be doing a little bit better. That first secret room was so lucky. That was, I can't, it's probably the best moment I've had in the game so far. So we got these guys. I do not have a key with which to open this item door. So that's going to be a sore spot for me. Range up is always a good, uh, always a good power up to get. If you remember, I got that a little while ago. Uh, I think in the item room is the last, it's the last level. Uh, because you can just hang out on one side of the map and essentially bombard them from far away. Not that this guy is hard to take out up close, but always better to be, uh, you know, at a safe distance. Makes a lot of the enemies a lot easier. Hopefully I can find a key soon. Ah, uh, these motherfuckers! I hate these guys. You often end up in a situation where it's just impossible for you to get out of it. As you can see, this is gonna be a little bit rough for me. That ball's of steel on that one. Can he come, can he turn around and come back at me? Maybe not? Okay, good. Heart, useful. But I could really use a key. And this looks like this room is going to be kind of a problem. Oh, no, absolutely not. I was talking out of my ass. Oh, there's the boss already. Wow. Now, secret room. We're putting money on it again. Probably to the right of this room. Let's check it. Oh, man. That, I'm, I'm not batting very well on guessing where the secret room is. Ah! Good thing I saved a bomb so I can open that treasure chest. And hopefully that treasure chest will drop some bombs for me as well. So I'm getting a little- Oh, whoa! Whoa! Alright. Bad play on my part there. Can't get to that penny, but I can get to this. And hopefully we'll get some bombs and keys inside of here. Bomb and a sense, you know? Profit made, I'll take it. I still need 27 cents in order to uh, unlock that new character. Oh, take out the ooze. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, and he's dead. Uh, and yeah, there's another dark rock here. Hopefully that'll drop a bomb and I'll get to this chest. But I don't have a key to open the other chest. Hopefully this chest has a key in it. Nope, but three cents and a bomb is not that bad either. But I could really really use some keys. Seems like this is happening to me a lot lately. And I don't waste keys, I tend to use them pretty sparingly. They just don't come up that often. I've seen so many comments of people like, yeah, on my first playthrough I got a skeleton key, which is basically like 99 keys. Um, no such luck for me. But hey, I've gotten some lucky items too. Again, I always go back to that uh, piercing uh, homing tier combo that I had, that I squandered. Where do I want to go now? There's another possible location for the secret room down here, but with only one bomb left, it seems a bit presumptuous or a bit risky for me to just go for it. Let's get this guy. These guys are kind of annoying just because they're so hard to hit. They run away from you. Uh, and they're pretty good at it, too. Ah, uh, there we go. We got him trapped in the corner. God damn, he belched a fly onto me. Grandfather flies. Take him out. Another scent. Pretty good on the money front. Unfortunately, I can't get to the shop even if I did want to spend my money. Sorry, dude. I, I can't get to you. Oh, I guess I could get to you. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's do it. This will be the first time that I've used a, a bomb to get across the bridge. Success. And then we're going to give this guy five cents, and he usually gives us an item. Kind of runs counter to uh, me trying to get as much money as possible. But still, you know. Eh? Yeah, see? I think I might be an HP up. 50% off. What does that mean? Does that mean every every item in the shop is 50% off? Because if so, I gotta get to that shop. This could be the one for me. Get the silkworms. Sloth tends to be a pretty easy boss to fight, especially when I've got this range up. Uh, certainly he's no he's no greed, no lust. Another tarot card and some more bombs. Okay. Tarot card is the hanged man. That seems risky. The picture is of Isaac. Hanging. Uh, so I don't feel good about using that. Did I already use... Where did I use my bomb to try to find that secret room? Because it looks like it's fucking gotta be that one in the center. Really wish I could open that treasure chest. It's gotta be that one in the center, but I'll, I'll try to use my memory to... Oh uh, yeah, I did place a bomb there. You can see that like vagina-like shape over there. Hmm, you know what? 
Let's just get this health and go fight the boss. I'm worried a bit about this tarot card, man. Peep! Oh, okay, this is my first time fighting Peep, I think. Uh, no idea what to expect, but it does seem like he creates toxic urine. So, I mean, that's generally, uh, bad news bears. Let's continually shoot him. Doesn't seem to be that hard so far. Oh, you know what? I have fought this guy before. You can shoot out both of his eyes and they start traveling around the room. You can kind of be a pain in the ass, I suppose. You gotta see a doctor, man. That is a serious problem. Maple syrup urine disease. Can I kill the eye? I can't remember. It looks like it's, I'm not doing any damage to it. Uh, but, you know, generally speak. Oh, that was bad of me. Generally speaking, Peep seems pretty easy. Which is good. Gertie always fucks with me, man. Uh, I find that boss so hard for some reason. And people in the comments are like, Man, Gertie is not that difficult at all. Uh, all you gotta do is X, Y, Z. But I've only beaten her once, and it wasn't time that on, it was on camera, so... Oh, what do we have here? My mom's underwear. Fantastic. Full health? Or no. Still half a heart down. Range up. Okay, that's good. The guy's starting to look a little funky. What level are we on now? The caves too. All right, pretty good run so far. Uh, don't um. Looks like he's got a turd poking out of his butthole. Okay. Twenty nine cents. Let's focus on getting. To Whoa. Okay, this is gonna be a dangerous room. Or maybe not. You know, maybe I'll just wander around here. How am I gonna get to those items to go to the center? I guess I'll place a bomb on the spikes. Do bombs blow up spikes? That would be really good for me. Otherwise, I'd have to take damage. Suppose I could use the hangman and potentially kill myself. Uh, just trying to get to a single key in the center. Alright, come on. This is getting this is goddamn ridiculous. Take some damage, please. That'll do it. Uh, no, it won't, actually, because it just keeps hitting the rock. Oh! Oh, that was super dumb of me. I'm, I'm having some trouble here. Okay, there's one down. I just keep strafing back and forth. I'll be fine. God damn it. My least favorite enemies. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I gotta get out of this guy's range. I remember now. Okay. Like this. Like this. Didn't even hit him. Oh! Yes, I did. Probably not worth the bomb in order to get that. I gotta take out these ooze guys as fast as I possibly can. Oh, uh, damn it. He came back. Uh, but then one hit takes them out. Yeah. Good, 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 good. Now, let me think of what my priorities are right now. I could really use some money. Uh, uh, duck! I, I can't get out of there! That was horrible on my part. Uh, I could really use some health now. Uh, that's definitely priority number one. Hmm. I really don't want to put myself in a position where I have to use this tarot card. That would be so heartbreaking for me to have it just end my game. Is Edmund McMillan that dickish? Do you think he would program something like that in? It would ruin my life. It, oh, Jesus Christ. You know, might not be an issue. I'm probably going to die by something else. By my own uh, inability to play the game well. Getting a little down on myself. Some hearts. I'm going to need to make a gamble for that secret room. Oh, oh Gish. Come on, buddy. You're, cre you're creating a problem for me. Oh, good. There's an... Oh, fuck. i got to get to that arcade. Tarot card. It's the only thing to do I could do. I don't know what it did. Ah, oh, fuck! I was doing so well too that turned out terribly. Oh, thank you guys for watching. Attempt six of the Binding of Isaac. When I sigh like that, I'm not mad at the game. I'm mad at myself. The game is really awesome. Hopefully, I know there's a certain contingent of people out there who like seeing failure on video, so I'm happy to oblige you by creating it. And getting killed by Gish is a little bit symbolic since I was let's playing that game once and then it just became too hard for me and pretty much killed my will in real life as well. Anyway, thank you guys for watching part 6, or attempt 6. I will see you in attempt 7. I promise I will be back. See you next time.